Here it comes, from the Bob Barker Studios in CBS City, Hollywood, television's most exciting show full of fantastic prizes, it's time for The Price is Right. And now, here's your host, the star of The Price is Right, Brandon Scruggs. Hey guys, what's going on? It is your boy B back with you once again for another edition of The Price is Right 2010 right here at MVG Productions. Glad you could join me here once again. Well, here we are into uh, 2021 now. The 2020 is behind us. And I believe this is the... Don't uh, don't get me wrong here, but I think this is the first one of these that's going to be on 20 and for 2021 so we're gonna hopefully try to finish this series up before the first half of the year is over with because i realize this series has been going on especially this particular game it's been going on over a year now and i'd like to personally put a bow on it and wrap it up and be done with it but you know we'll see what happens depends on if the randomizer is nice to me today we'll see um let's see last time we left off we have 27 of the 32 games unlocked we are missing five those five games that we're on the lookout for, of course, are Cliffhangers, Flip Flop, Golden Road, Lucky Seven, and Three Strikes. I don't remember playing Lucky Seven or Three Strikes the last couple episodes. So I'm hoping those two come up in the rotation, but we'll see what happens today. But anyway, you know how this works. I play through all the games until I unlock them, and then to finish the series, we play through all 32 games, one after the other, to see what and see what our overall final total for the game for a marathon will be. So let's get into it. I'm ready to play. Hopefully, you're ready to have fun with me. Let's play some Prices Right. Let's do it. Here it comes. As we head on down to contestants row for our first time up for Your goal is to win as much money and fabulous prizes as you can before getting three strikes. Welcome to contestants row. The contestant with the bid closest to the actual retail price of the item, without going over, wins the item and gets to come up on stage to play a pricing game. Here is the item up for bids. The Price is Right tugboat is bringing out the next prize, a new washer and dryer. Oh, okay. Good way to start. I think I can price them pretty well. From Whirlpool, an Ultimate Care washer with 21 auto cycles and a super capacity electric dryer with multi combinations and wide opening hamper door. From Whirlpool Home Appliances, giving you the power to get more done. Let's see who bids the closest without going over. I'm going to say 10 years ago, those would have been about 1100 so $799. William says 18 and 17 Diane says 7 It's your turn to bid. Well, I'm going to bid. I said 1100 first. But I think I'm gonna back off and go a thousand dollars. This item's actual retail price is nine eighteen. I was a little too much. Should have dropped another hundred. Went back to nine. This is your first okay. strike. Don't worry, you still have two to go. First strike of the day. Not too particularly worried. So let's see what we can do here to play a price again. You're going to play Cliff. Oh snap! Here we go. Chance to win Cliff. twenty thousand. Cliffhangers out the box. This is one of the ones we need to you do. You have to guess the so actual let's, retail let's price of each well. item. For every dollar you miss, high or low, the hiker takes one step up the mountain. Right. If he goes too far, he falls off the mountain and you lose. Right. If he stays on the path, you win. That's the whole idea. Let's see what you'll bid on. First item, please. Our first item is... The giant buttons and extra large size of this remote make it easy to use and hard to lose. Tell me what you think is the price of this item. Giant remote is uh, 18 bucks. Is that right? Let's see how many steps he'll take. All right, yodel guy. Off by five. The hiker's still on the okay, path. Off by seven. Let's return to the items. Oh, was it 25? Okay. Next up is... This unique looking CD rack holds 34 CDs among a shimmering column of glowing glitter. And the price of this one? All right, it's so a CD rack, glitter in the middle. I think you could sell that for $29. Although, sadly, I think that one might be $25, too. So I'm going to say $29. Is that right? Let's see how many steps he'll take. The hiker's still on okay, the path. we're good. Let's return to the items. How much was it? 27 Okay. 
The final item you'll bid on is... I'm on nine, so I can miss the this one by about world 16. Of Wonderland with this doll inspired by the Queen of Hearts. What is the price of this last item? Okay, I can miss this last one by as much as 16 one way or another, and I'll get this game. Um... For the... Doll, we're going to say, because it's probably name brand, I'm going to go $35. As long as it's, let's see, $16 range, that would drop it to $25.24 to... Yeah, as long as this is promo from between 24 and 51, I think I'm a winner. I'm going to go $35. Is it right? All right. Let's see how many steps he'll take. Don't be more than 51. Don't be more than 51. The hiker. Yeah, the let's you go. Win. Give me some bells. Nice. You set a new high score. Congratulations. There we go. $20,000. And we got cliffhangers out the box. Let's go, You've earned a new baby. Congratulations. <laughs> All right. That's one down. We got four to it's go. Time Let's get to the, the wheel. Showdown. It's your turn to spin the wheel. All right. Good start to this episode. We are already one game down. And we're going to see what we can do. 65. Um, 65. Would you like to spin, I'll spin again for 35? 65 cents in my first spin. 30 would be awesome. 35, 35. Hold it. No. You got over one dollar. So cool. Sorry. Better luck next time. I overshot it. <laughs> oh well. All right, so not getting the showcase yet, but again, still, I'm happy of this episode already because I got one game unlocked. Welcome to Contestants Row. Here is the item up for bids. It's a lovely swing. Ooh. Sunset Swings presents this comfortable pendulum swing featuring sealed ball bearing pivots which provide a smooth, relaxing motion. Feel the difference with Sunset Swings. Let's see who bids the closest right. without going over. It's a nice Sunset Swing. Let's say 1,200. Honest to 710. Ollie says $22.99. Jerry says five forty nine. What is your bid? I feel like I'm overbidding again. So I'd say twelve hundred a day. So let's knock off three hundred. Let's go nine hundred again. This item's actual retail, retail price, price is eight ninety five. Wow. Over by you got five dollars. Strike. Be careful. One more, and it's game over. That hurts right there, folks. That just straight up. That's just rude. Rude. But anyway, let's get another game. This is your chance to win up to right. sixteen thousand okay. dollars. We're gonna place in the bag Let's again. Let's play. It's in the bag. Let's see what we can do with this one. Let's start by showing you the items you'll be bidding on today. First, our first, first item is CLR power plumber drain opener for toilet sinks and drains. A quick blast of pressurized gas forces through buildups of hair, soap, and grease. Safely blows through clogs while cleaning and deodorizing as it works. Okay. Relatively expensive. Next up is. See what you've been missing with Luma Tweez, the light of tweezer with a flip-up magnifier. Ooh. Luma Tweez lets you get even the That's finest hairs and has no slip tips for a precise like tweezing every time. like if they don't have four-digit prizes on this one. Your next item is... For a quick and easy snack, crunchy granola bars make a tasty choice. Those are like two-something. Finally, our last item. Chocolate chip cookies can snack put a smile cookies. on your face. Right. A perfect snack anytime. I think I can price the last two. It's the first two that are going to be a pain in the butt. You have four items and five price tags. Put a price tag on each item. If you match all four items with the correct tags, you win $16,000. Let's get to work then. Tell me what you think is the price of this item. All right. Um, the $9.99 I already know is for the battery power tweezers. So if I had to go with the next one, I'd say it's probably five seventy-eight. So I'm going to go five seventy-eight for the CLR. $9 and now, for give me a price for this item. Now this item. Now here comes the kicker. Because I know the Chips Ahoy cookies are 55 cents. Is the Nature Valley Nature Valley 317 or 329? Uh, traditionally, I think they're in the, um, they usually end in nine. So I'm going to go 329. 
And finish this one off with 55. What is the price of this last item? All right. For $2,000, is this the correct price? Yes. yes. Nice. Do you want to keep the $2,000 or risk it for $4,000? Oh, we're going. Because I know this one's not For $4,000, is this Light the correct up. price? Yes. Do you want to keep the $4,000 or risk it for $8,000? Now, this is the tricky one. If I get this one right, I know I've got sixteen grand. Mm, let's see. Do I go for it? Um, I'm going to go because I think 329 is right. For $8,000, is this the correct price? Yes. Nice. Do you want to keep the eight thousand? All the way, baby. Sixteen thousand dollars. Give me my money. Dollars. Is this the correct price? Congratulations! You win sixteen thousand dollars. Nice. You set a new high score. <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> Applause, please. Thank you. Thirty-six thousand ninety-nine dollars as we head back to the big wheel. It's time for the showcase showdown. It's your turn to spin the wheel. Good spin there. And our first spin this time will do better. Well, not as good as 65. 70. 70. Would you like to spin I'll again? I'll stay on 70. Stand next to the wheel. Let's see if 70 will hold up. Moana gets her first spin. And her first spin is going to come to a stop on a 45 cents. 45. I thought it was going to be a dime. Take your second spin. All right, so she needs what? 25 to 55, and she beats me. 25, she ties, so 30 to 55, she goes on. And I'm out of this round. No 30, no. Dime's good. Dime is good. Dime is fine. Perfect. 55. Your total is less okay. than the leader. Sorry, better luck next 70 time. 70 is holding for now. Let's see what Jerry does. Jerry's first spin is going to need a second one because he's got 55. 55. Take your second spin. All right, so he needs 20 to 45. 20 to 45, he beats me. Your total is... And he's right in the sweet spot. Come on, 75. Yes! You went over $1. Sorry. Better luck next okay. time. Okay. Snuck away with the victory there, and I'll take it. I'm going to the showcase, baby. This will not be a showcase for show on this one. I'm happy about that. Let's see what we're playing for Welcome today. Welcome to the showcase. Let's go. Each of you. The showcase has a park ranger describing some tourist destinations that didn't quite catch up. Okay. First, there's the Bland Canyon, a place so unimpressive that everyone visiting there chooses to watch videos of prettier places on their new portable DVD player. Enjoy nice. all your favorite movies anywhere you are on this sleek 7-inch display portable DVD player. And then there's the not-so-popular area known as the Fat Adirondacks, a place so obsessed with weight loss that the only amenity each hotel offers is the use of a new treadmill. The Bodyguard T460X Personal Trainer Treadmill uses a new that, technology honestly. that allows for the personalization of your training program, features both decline and elevation modes from Bodyguard. Finally, there's Mellowstone National Park, a place so laid back that no one ever bothers to come out of their brand new trailer. Okay. The 26-foot Trail Manor fold-down travel trailer is designed to give you the comfort of a full-size travel trailer at the campsite and the ease of towing a pop-up trailer when traveling. And this showcase in which our ranger decides to come visit a place that really is exciting can be yours if the price is right. I'll take it. You're the top winner. Will you bid on this showcase or pass it to the other player? Um, I will bid on the showcase. How much do you think your showcase is worth? All right, so portable DVD player, the treadmill, and the pop-up trailer. All right, so I'm going to say the trailer is like 17. The treadmill would be like 2. And the, the what of a DVD, so I'm thinking at least 20 grand. So I'm going to go 20 even and see how I feel about that. Might be underbidding it. We'll Your see. showcase is... 
or showcase is I don't care. What do you think is the value of your show? Not not to be rude to the computer at all, but again, I don't care, and we're just trying to keep this thing moving. Anyway, 15200 is what he bids on his showcase, and let's find out what the actual your retail price is. is worth 25310 for a for difference, a difference of, of $10,110. Nice your house. showcase is My worth, showcase is worth $30,344 for a, a difference, difference of $10,344. Wow. You lost the showcase. Better luck next beat time. beat me by $224. Ouch. Welcome to Contestant's Row. Harsh. The contestant with the bid closest to the actual retail strikes, price of the so item. I got if I don't win this one, this episode is going to be wrapped up very quickly. On stage to play. Here is the item up Let's for bid. Let's see bids. what we're playing for. It's an illuminated globe. Okay. This one's the like global states seven one inch illuminated globe is mounted on a hardwood base finished in walnut with a full solid brass hand engraved meridian. Let's see who bids the closest without going over. 900 may not be too far gone. We'll see. Sharon says 1749. Jennifer says 1980. Lena says It's your turn to bid. Uh, I'm going to bid about 350. Because I think you're all over. The actual retail price is? $2,800. You lose. Never mind. Oh, no. This is your third strike. Sorry, but it's game over. Well, not the way I wanted to go out. But, hey, a win is a win. you got to pick it up wherever you can. $36,099 today. But more importantly, we did pick up one of the games we needed. We did manage to find um, Cliffhanger, so that leaves four left. Flip Flop, Golden Road, Lucky Seven, and Three Strikes. Will we get them on the next one? You'll have to find out then. If we're all out of time for this episode, thank you so much for watching some more of the Price is Right 2010 edition here on the channel. If you like game show games and want to see other game show games that are played here, including some of our series, make sure you click that subscribe button down below and ring the bell. That way you never miss out on all the fun and games going down here at MVG Productions. And help me reach my 1,000 subscriber goal before the end of 2021. Hopefully before this year's game show marathon is what I'm aiming for, but we'll see what happens. In the meantime, between time, be kind to one another, help control the virus population, make sure you wear your mask, wash your face, wash your hands, and wash your ass. Thanks for watching, guys. See y'all next time.